Hasbullah has come to his cage side seat to take this one in. German man in the cage, Peter Lavery. Breslin is in the black trunks. Mark Andrew was in the gray. Touch of gloves were on their way. And Big shot over the top to open up from Breslin. Big knee from Andrew there too. Slick southpaw one two. He's finding a home for that straight left now. Andrew just putting Breslin up against the cage and leaning his mask right in front of his corner as well. It'll be interesting to see how Breslin copes with the transition. This being his first professional bout. This being the seventh professional bout in the career of Andrew. Nice smothering work being done so far by Mark Andrew. Leaning in on Breslin, but Breslin staying calm in his position, almost waiting for his opportunity to either dig an underhook or try and spin out the back. Tried to create a little bit of separation there, was in the vice-like grip of Breslin. Nice knees by Breslin. There is a lot of space there in between the two fighters to, to get real purchase on your knees. Big high crotch. Yeah. Good balance Good from Breslin. Balance. Kieran Breslin managed to stay in on his feet. Excellent work. And again, we, we, we called it earlier, smothering work, but this is smothering work by Andrew. And Trying to push back is Breslin. Breslin essentially chased the whole way across the cage there. Landed a nice short uppercut on the way in for the clinch. Right in front of Hezbollah as well here. I wonder if he'll be shouting instruction. Um, oh! Just shy with the step and elbow was Andrew. Breslin trying to back Mark Andrew up and he has done so and that's a nice knee, but nice knee answer by Andrew. And just doesn't seem to be just a purchase on either shot by both men. Both men are trying to get their work away in the clinch, but as you say, not quite clean. Nothing's landed flush in the clinch from either man, but nice just as I cut. say yeah. that, yeah. nice short corkscrew uppercut. Good head movement from Andrew. You can almost see both men as they're engaged. They're almost tucking, expecting the takedown and yeah. being defensive of that. Both sitting low. June 2019 was the last time we saw Mark Andrew in the cage. Clearly has added a few new wrinkles to his game since then. Holding the Muay Thai plum. Drops into a single, lands a nice knee and elbow there. Real back and forth kind of round. No, yeah, again, yeah. super difficult for the judges to try and score. Breslin trying to pull down on that whizzer. Again, a little bit of a stalemate as we see the fighters in the 50-50 position. Just as nice I say knee. that. Yeah, again, and excellent work on the inside by Mark Andrew. Andrew doing a fantastic job not to rush his work here. Breslin tries to close in, but again, Andrew pulls the plug. Oh! Step in elbows. That's a gorgeous Tamalai elbow. Just stepped in, breaks right through the guard. That was sumptuous. Mixing up his shots here with his hands. Good head movement to get out of trouble. And nice footwork by Andrew. Tries to drive to the body. Oh, nice big shot. counter by Breslin. Oh! Breslin oh, he's, he's out! Oh! He's knocked out Mark Andrew! What? It was the right hand! But what a finish! That is absolutely huge. After eating some massive shots from Mark Andrew, I'll be honest, I thought Mark Andrew was starting the sequence that he would finish the fight with. Yeah. But Breslin just in the blink of an eye, and if anything, this gives credence and proves the old adage that anything can and will happen in mixed martial the arts. The power he generated, Phil, in that short distance 
And you can see Andrews dropped to his knees and the second shots, third shots, yep. seemed to wake him up from his slumber. It was a beautiful shot by Breslin. Unfortunately, we don't have replays in front of us here, but it just seemed to me, looking at it live, it seemed to be a right shot just as Andrew was backing up. Dropped him against the post of the cage. The second shot came in that turned off the lights, but what a turnaround, as you said, Phil. It yeah. looked like Mark Andrew was starting the sequence of finishing the fight. Huge, absolutely huge. And, and yes, on the face of it, Mark Andrew may be one and six as a professional mixed martial artist, but try and tell me that's not the most dangerous one in six fighter in the world right now. Still pretty wobbly on his feet here.